We are called to participate in this not-so-triumphant entry into Jerusalem, into the ways of Jesus, and invited into the ways of his cross. Because remember, every single one of the Gospels show the cross and the resurrection as his enthronement. The language is there as him becoming king. What the world sees as shame, violence, suffering, death. We see the enthronement of the king and the power of his kingdom on display. So for those of you who feel impoverished, powerless, unimportant, suffering, grieving, hurting, forgotten, blessed are you. For it's with you that the kingdom of God, his power, is breaking into this world. And for those of us who maybe can't relate to that, we are called to walk alongside people such as these. So that way we can bring about and announce God's power and authority, his rule and his reign, his gospel. So that is how Jesus in this text, in this word, is inviting all of us into living out his power and his authority, to walk his ways, his humble, loving, charitable ways. And we have seen in our own history how powerful that can be, how world-changing that can be.